to the news now. And this afternoon we learned that all students at Buffalo Public Schools will be returning to in-person education five days a week starting next Monday, January 3rd. The district making that announcement just a few hours ago. With that in mind, plans are moving forward to get at-home testing kits in the hands of parents with the return of children to schools next week. The overall effort by the state and local districts to keep healthy kids in class is also underway despite the increasing number of COVID cases. Channel 2's Ron Plants checked in with some other local superintendents today. Just yesterday, school superintendents from across the state had the chance to hear directly from Governor Hochul. There was a really reaffirming statement that she made that the best place for kids to be is in school. And to back up those words in the face of the ever increasing COVID case counts, Hochul and her state health commissioner sought to brief them on the state's plans to provide millions of COVID at home antigen tests so the children can be tested with a resumption of classes on Monday. The understanding there may have been exposure at family gatherings or other events during their holiday break and the realization that most kids, especially ages 5 to 11, still have not been vaccinated. Trying to put in the hands of families uh, of school aged children one test uh, for every school aged child that they can choose to use in advance of returning to school on Monday, um, you know, just as an other layer of mitigation to add to the other layered mitigation strategies we've been using in schools like um, masking and checking of symptoms and hand washing and um, you know physical distancing and the like. Obviously there's the logistics issues of getting all those tests distributed through the state's BOCES centers to the school districts and ultimately parents and kids by either the end of this week or early next week as district leaders work out how to notify parents on details. How to pick up the test? how to use them, and most importantly, how to report what they read. Uh, there are details within that statement that really need to be hammered out. But again, primarily parents should think of the test as a tool. The purpose was not to raise alarm bells about the safety of schools come Monday. Schools are going to be as safe Monday as they have been throughout the COVID era. It's just another layer of mitigation that the governor is offering to schools and families. And we'll do our best to get them distributed in advance of Monday. But the reality of it is we don't even know if we're going to get them in time. Ron Plants, Channel 2 News.